Hey everyone, Mama Micah here, and today I'm doing an impressions video of Rise of the Tomb Raider for Xbox One. I got this game for Christmas and was so excited to play it. I beat the main story within a week, and I still have so much left to play on it. There's challenges, there's side quests, there's so much to explore in this world, and I can't wait to get back into it. So the 2013 game I played and loved, and I actually liked the story in that one just a teeny bit more than this one. I was more invested in the characters and the overall story, but I still enjoyed this game very much. They took all the good things from the 2013 game and just improved upon them in this one. The map is even better, the combat is even better, the upgrade system is even better. They've only improved upon things. They really didn't make any mistakes with this game. There was nothing that I said, oh, they brought that back. I really enjoyed this game and couldn't find anything wrong with it. The graphics look phenomenal, both in cutscenes and in gameplay. It's a good looking game and it, I can't find anything wrong with it in that department either. If you haven't played the first game, they do reference it a few times, but not in a way that would spoil the first game if you plan on playing it, or in a way that you have to play the first game to get the whole story. Occasionally, Lara will say things like, that last adventure changed me, and I can't forget the things I've seen before. If you've played the 2013 game, you'll know what she's talking about, and it kind of rounds the story out, and it gives you that motivation for this next adventure. But you don't need to play the first game to understand that, okay, whatever happened before was important, and it's what's pushing us forward in this game. And it doesn't spoil the story of the first one. If you do play this game, and you want more Tomb Raider, you can go back and play the last one, and I highly recommend playing that one first. It really rounds out the whole story, and it makes you appreciate the improvements in this game. So let me know in the comments below if you plan on playing Rise of the Tomb Raider, or if you've already played it. Did you play both games, or did you only play the newest one? Let me know down below what you think of it. Like, comment, subscribe if you want to see more, and I'll see you next time. Bye!